Hey Uppers! So today we made a special video for you. It's basically going to be an A to Z dictionary for tips about rabbits. Um, the reason I made this video is because of our last video when your bunny is a diva. Which is a very funny video, you have to watch it if you haven't yet. Um, I don't know if you remember but I added some note, some comment at the end saying that uh, our channel is not about uh, tips for rabbits but I decided that we need to give you some good tips to share with people who own rabbits or are thinking about getting one um, you basically should save this video and share it with people that you think they need to know more about rabbits uh, it's a video to be saved for sure so we're going to start with A. A. A is for age. Rabbits can live a long time. Um, rabbits can live for even more than 12 years. And people should know that rabbits are a big commitment. And once you decide that you are going to have a rabbit, you should know that it might be with you for a very long time. So keep this in mind. A is also for adopt. When you're thinking about getting a rabbit, consider adopting a rabbit from a local shelter. There are so many rabbits out there that are waiting to meet you and be placed in good homes. Remember, when possible, adopt, don't shop. B is for bowl. Be sure to use a sturdy ceramic bowl for water for your rabbit. A lot of the pet supply stores these days are selling water bottles with metal tips at the end. Those are much better suited for rats or mice. A rabbit should drink out of a ceramic bowl. That's the most natural way for a rabbit to drink. Binky. Get to know your rabbit's behavior. When you see binkies, it's a sign of happiness. I like seeing Binny and his binkies. It's so fun, it's so cute. And it means that he's happy. And this is the most important thing. C. C is for cage. Buy as big of a cage as you possibly can for your rabbits. A bunny's habitat is critical to their comfort and overall well-being. They'll be healthy and happy if they can stretch their legs, relax, and have a little bit of room to run around inside the cage. Companionship. Rabbits do best in pairs or groups, unless you are able to be home more than 10 hours per day, like me, <laughs> uh, to give your rabbits attention and love all day. <laughs> They just want love and attention, so having a companion is advised. D. Down low. Get down on the floor with bunnies. <laughs> Rabbits like when you go on the floor and be on the same level as them, as if you're another rabbit or another something that they can trust. Most rabbits don't like being picked up. It's the best when you're on the floor with them, same level of eyes. They like it a lot and they'll trust you more. Uh, trust me, it's a good tip. E is for ears. Check your rabbit's ears regularly, especially lap rabbits or other breeds that have ears that hang low to the floor. You need to look out for infection or buildup of mucus. Those are signs that it's time to go see the vet. F is for free. Free reign of the house is a great thing for your rabbit. As long as you've properly bunny proofed, then the bunnies should be able to run around, explore new areas, and of course flop wherever their hearts desired. G is for groats. Oat groats are a treat that rabbits go nuts for. They can be found in most feed stores and can be used as a treat, or reward for training. H is for hay. Rabbits should have access to unlimited hay at any time, day or night. Hay is the best source of nutrition for a rabbit, hands down. Rabbit foods and other processed foods are a lot of sugar. Rabbits can live on practically hay alone. I, intelligent. Ooh, I like this one. Well, you already know by watching Binny's videos how smart bunnies can be. Um, yeah, I don't say that your bunny should play basketball or paint, but um, your rabbits can do amazing things if you just give them enough attention. You can teach them some easy tricks like uh, uh, dogs, for example, and people don't know that. Uh, but rabbits are very, very smart and they 
uh, they like to calculate and uh, they like to jump very high and all you need is to give them enough attention and love and you'll be surprised to see what they can do. I was surprised to see. I think everyone is surprised to know that rabbits are smart by watching our videos. Um, but uh, try to play with them more. Day is for jump. Remember, rabbits can jump really high. So make sure that as you bunny proof your house, you secure anything that could be dangerous to your bun, even if it's on a table or countertop. K kisses. If you are a good owner, you are going to get kisses from your rabbit. Uh, kisses, I mean licks or nose bumps. And if you do get them, uh, I would like you to comment here and I want to know the good owners that we have here as our subscribers. It's a really good feeling to get a kiss from your bunny. It means that you're doing a, a good job. L is for litter box. A lot of people don't realize you can litter train your rabbit. In order to prevent the rabbit from peeing around the house, be sure to use a layer of rabbit safe bedding. And we also suggest putting a pet pad on top to make it easy to clean and absorb the liquid. If you want them to stop pooping in the house, stay tuned to hear our golden tip on the letter P. M is for manicure. Remember, just like humans, rabbits need their nails clipped on a regular basis. M is also for mammals. Remember, rabbits are not a rodent, despite the misconception that a lot of people have. Rabbits are a mammal. N is for night. Rabbits can become super active at night, so don't be surprised if your rabbit seems really wound up as you are trying to wind down for the day. Try to give them attention and allow them to play during the times that they are naturally most active. O is obesity. Always monitor your rabbit's weight to ensure they are not gaining weight beyond their healthy range. Ask your vet what the healthy weight ranges should be for your rabbit's breed, age, and size. Also, too much processed pet food, fruits, or other high sugar snacks can lead to obesity, so feed them these as treats and in moderation, of course. P is for poop. Now this is our golden tip here. Do you want your bunny to stop pooping all around the house? Then try this. Put your rabbit's fresh hay inside his or her litter box, and be sure to replenish it frequently. Your bunny will eat there and poop at the same time. Of course, it's important to change the box regularly to keep it clean. Also, be sure to monitor the color and size of your bunny's poop as this is a telltale sign of whether he is a happy and healthy rabbit. Q is for quality time. You should spend as much quality time as you can with your rabbits. Rabbits can feel love just like humans can. R is for risky. Did you know there are certain fruits and vegetables that can be risky and even potentially deadly to your rabbit? Be sure you know exactly what you can and can't give them. And if you have any doubts, check with a local rabbit expert or your vet to make sure that you're giving them only rabbit safe and approved fruits and veggies. S is for salad. Your rabbit should get about a handful or so of salad a day, depending on the size or the weight of the rabbit, of course. The mix should include things like fresh veggies, fresh herbs, and various kinds of lettuce. The rabbit gets most of their key vitamins and minerals from those vegetables, so be sure to give it to them every single day. S is also for shedding. Rabbits can shed a number of times throughout the year depending on the seasons and of course the weather. So don't be surprised if you see a bunch of hair on the floor from your bunnies. It's very important to make sure that you groom your rabbits regularly by brushing them or taking your hands and running them through their coats. This will remove some of the excess hair during shedding times and of course make sure that they don't swallow any hair which can get stuck in their system. T is for teeth. The condition of a rabbit's teeth is typically a sign of their overall health, so be sure to inspect them regularly. U is under wear? Sometimes your rabbit may go missing in the house. Since they like to be in sheltered, safe spaces, they sometimes find refuge under a bed, under a sofa, or even under a cabinet unit. So look out for them in all kinds of hidden places. U is also unlimited hay. I know we've talked about unlimited hay being very important to a rabbit's diet, but we can't stress it enough that it's important for a rabbit to have access to fresh hay at all times. This helps for their digestive system, their teeth, and of course, keeping them overall healthy and happy. V is for vet. 
Find a special rabbit-friendly vet in your area and make sure you have their emergency contact details on hand in case you need them. W is for water. It's best to keep your rabbit hydrated at all times and be sure that you're filling his or her water bowl with fresh, filtered, or even bottled water. Sometimes tap water contains impurities that can be harmful to rabbits, so many experts say that it's best to keep your rabbit healthy by giving them filtered water. X is for XOXO. Oh wait, we already did kisses. Um, you know what? You can never give your rabbit enough kisses. If you have a better word for X, comment below. Y is for young. Younger rabbits require some special consideration and care. First off, it's really important to give your young rabbits alfalfa hay. This is good to develop their internal systems and of course keep them healthy and growing. Secondly, younger rabbits can be more sensitive to extreme temperatures, so be sure that you put them in a place in your house where there is a good temperature regulation and of course don't expose them to temperatures that are too hot or too cold. Z is for zoom. Your rabbit can zoom quickly all around the house, so be careful where you step as you might just be surprised to see your bunny right by your feet. Okay hoppers, I hope you had fun watching our rabbit tips A to Z dictionary. I hope you learned something new. Um, please comment below and let us know what you learned about rabbits today. What surprised you? What didn't you know? And don't forget to subscribe. And we're working on new videos for you. So that's it for now. Bye. Mwah.